Jackson County. Means we're close to Jackson City, right? Shouldn't be more than a few miles. You ready to see dear old brother? I'm just ready to get there. You nervous? I don't know what I'm feeling. What happened between you two? What do you mean? You and Tommy. You're not together, so clearly something went down. We just had a bit of a disagreement, that's all. Ah, here we go. So what was it about? Tommy saw the world one way, I saw it the other. And that's why he joined the Fireflies. <laughs> yeah, your friend Marlene promised him hope. That kept him busy for a while, but just like Tommy, he eventually quit that too. How was it the last time you saw him? I believe his last words to me were, I don't ever want to see your goddamn face again. Jeez. Oh, but he's gonna help us? I suppose we're gonna find out. Well, if they're without his help, we'll get there. Let's just keep going. Whoa, what's that? that right there's a hydroelectric power plant. <laughs> I, a hydro who? It, uh, it uses the river's movement and uh, turns it into electricity. How does it do that? Look, I know what it is. I don't know how it does it. Right. Hey, be careful crossing that thing. Team I will. One. Really? Just gonna leave me hanging? All right. Let's see how it is. Just give it five. Five. Don't even think about reaching for your weapon. Tell the girl to drop hers now. Ellie, do as the lady says. Hey, please tell me you're lost. Oh, we didn't know the place was occupied. We're just trying to make our way through. Through to where? They're all right. But you know these people? I know him. He's my goddamn brother, Tommy. Holy shit. What are you doing, baby brother? God damn. Yeah. Let me look at you. You get fucking old. Easy. It's going to happen to you, too. This is Maria. Be nice to her. She sort of runs things around here. Ma'am, thanks for not blowing my head off. Would have been embarrassing, considering you're my brother in law. We all gotta get wrangled up at some point. Oh. Ellie, right? Yeah. What brings you through here? Uh... That's kind of a long story. Why don't we bring him inside? Yeah. You hungry? Starving. False alarm! They're friendlies. We've been dealing with raids. A lot of bandits in this area. It's been quiet for a few days. What the hell are you doing here? I thought I'd find you in Jackson. Been trying to bring the plant back to life. We had it working before, but one of the turbines went south. We have electricity, Joel. I had. We'll get it running again. No way. You guys have horses. We got a whole lot of them. Hey, Tommy, give me a hand with this. Sorry, I'll be right back. Can I? Yeah, of course. He likes when you pet his ears. You ever ride one? I actually have. When have you ridden a horse? Uh, Winston, this soldier back in his own, he gave me lessons. You know, if you want, we can take him riding later. That'd be awesome. There. Hey, thanks, Tommy. No sweat. All right, let's continue the tour. Earl? Yeah? Why are you here? Weren't you supposed to head back this morning? Still waiting on Hauser and the rest of the boys to relieve me. Oh, no. You know, we'll be fine. Just go home to your family. It's just a couple more hours. I'll tough it out. All right. Look, take it easy.
Maria. Yeah, go ahead. We're in the control room. Steve's about to start it back up. You want to come check it out? <sighs> I'd rather eat with Ellie. It's my turn anyway. I'll go. I'll come with you. Go with Maria. Put some food in. Joel. Come on, Ellie. Let's give the boys some space. I'm sending Tommy over. Stand by. This will be the sixth time of them trying to get the turbines back online. We've been here just a week, and it feels like forever. Uh, I got something for you. Last year, I went back to Texas, back home. Most of our stuff is long gone. Most of it. Here. It's a little faded, but it still looks pretty good. I'm good. You sure? I mean... I said I'm good. Okay. Well, I'll hold on to it for you. Tommy, I... I need to talk to you. Privately. Yeah, okay. Let me just check on my guys real quick. Come on. I don't know what you heard, but you should see the town. We're over 20 families strong now. It was Maria and her father. They set up this place with the idea of being self-sustained. We had crops and livestock. Remember how we thought no one could live like this anymore? We're doing it. What do you do for protection? The adults take turns guarding the perimeter. We even got an electrified fence when we plant it. Well, we still gotta deal with infected though, right? Who doesn't? But it's the world we live in. Or maybe you don't have to be. <laughs> you sound like Marlene. Hey, buddy. That's Buckley. Not much of a guard dog. Maybe good to have around. <laughs> That's a good boy. These two geniuses are gonna bring this plant back to life. We think we got it this time. <laughs> you don't believe us? I didn't say that. I'll bet you a million bucks it works. Sure, make it two. Uh, we're almost ready. They just need to finish putting the shield back on. No rush. To the left. Watch it. Okay, that's good. Lower it. Slowly. All right. That's good. Tommy's here. We good to go? Give me one second. Okay, good to go. Ready? Go ahead. Hit it. Here we go. Oh, <laughs> God damn. We did it, boys. Nice work, boys. Somebody get on the horn and give Maria the good news. You see that? Yeah, pretty impressive. Looks like you're out two million bucks. <laughs> All right, Joe. Let's go talk. It's quite the crew you got here. Yeah, they're good men. This place gives them a second chance. Gives us all a second chance. So why'd you leave Boston? I've been on quite the adventure, little brother. I reckon it's got something to do with that girl. <laughs> it's got everything to do with that little girl. Well, go on then. She's immune. Immune to what? I've oh, seen come her, on. I know, I've seen her breathe enough spores to take down a dozen men, and nothing. Now, I wouldn't have believed it neither, but I can show you. All right. I'll bite. Why bring her here? I was supposed to deliver to the Fireflies. 
the way I figure they're your boys. You finish the job, you collect the whole damn payment. I haven't seen a firefly in years. But you know where they are. Now, I'm not asking for much, Tommy. I just want some simple gear, enough to set me on my way. What makes you think I'd do this for you? This isn't for me, Tommy. This is for your damn cause. My cause is my family now. You ain't talking about some walk in the park here. Jesus, boy. Have Maria get some of your born-again friends to do it. They but got I... families, too. Tommy, I need this. You want some gear? Sure. But I ain't taking that girl off your hands. This is how you gonna repay me, huh? Repay you? For all those goddamn years I took care of us. Took care? That's what you call it? I got nothing but nightmares from those years. You survived because of me. It wasn't worth it. I bring you the cure from mankind, and you want to play the pissy little brother. We ain't back in Boston. You lay your hands on me again, it won't end well for you. The hell is that? We're under attack. You still remember how to kill, right? Yeah. Shit! Bandit! Stop him! Don't let him into the building! Let's get a move on! That's all, those sons of bitches! We gotta get to the girls! Right behind you! I hear him running! Joe, do your thing. Too damn close. You okay? Yeah, 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 I'm fine. Oh, oh man. They were coming in from every direction, then Maria was like, we gotta run, and so we dove over these tables, and this huge guy blasted with a shotgun. Slow down, slow down, slow down. Listen, hey, hey, are you hurt? No. God damn it. I need to talk to you. Absolutely not. You tell him to go find somebody else. Maria, I can't have this hanging over my head. Do you have any idea how many men we lost here today? Hey, what's that all about? Does that have anything to do with me? We'll talk about it later. Did he tell you where the lab is? We'll talk about it later. Later. Right. and then I turn into one of those widows, okay? I have to do this. I don't know what else to say. Fine. Maria. Maria. Here we go. You. If anything, anything at all happens to him, it's on you. She's thankful, you know. Yeah, I know. I'll take that girl of yours to the Fireflies. You don't have to worry about it. It's best this way. Well, maybe some real good will come of this. I need to talk to Ellie. Say again, I didn't hear you. Joe! What, what is it? That girl of yours, she took one of our horses and rode off. Damn it. Which way? Come on. I just saw her riding on out of here. Go back inside. Help the others clean the place up. Okay. Be careful out there. There. See the tracks? Yeah. Let's go. Whoa, 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 whoa! whoa. I got your back. How many do you see? Too goddamn Got many. Go around, I'll cover you. That's all of them. Come on, back to the horses.
Look, by the ranch. That's our horse. She's got to be there. Come. There he looks clear. Ellie! Keep an eye out. Reckon you guys need to have a chat. Is this really all they had to worry about? Boys? Movies? Deciding which shirt goes with which skirt? It's bizarre. Get up. We're leaving. Come on. And if I say no? Do you even realize what your life means? Huh? Running off like that, putting yourself at risk? It's pretty goddamn stupid. Well, I guess we're both disappointed with each other then. What do you want from me? Admit that you wanted to get rid of me the whole time. Tommy knows this area. Oh, better fuck than... that. Well, I'm sorry. I trust him better than I trust myself. Stop with the bullshit. What are you so afraid of? That I'm gonna end up like Sam? I can't get infected. I can take care of myself. How many close calls have we had? Well, we seem to be doing all right so far. And now you'll be doing even better with Tommy. Not her, you know. What? Maria told me about Sarah. Ellie? And... You are treading on some mighty thin ice here. I'm sorry about your daughter, Joel. But I have lost people, too. You have no idea what loss is. Everyone I have cared for has either died or left me. Everyone fucking except for you. So don't tell me that I would be safer with someone else, because the truth is I would just be more scared. Sure as hell ain't your dad. But we are going our separate ways. Get it together. We're not alone. I got two walking in. There's more inside already. clear. Let's get back to the horses. We're clear. There she is. Kids will be watching movies tonight. Where is this lab of theirs? It's all the way out, University of Eastern Colorado. Go big horns. 
Ellie, get off your horse. Give it on back to Tommy. I'm gonna hang on to this fella. That's all right with you. Go on, don't make me repeat myself. What are you doing? Your wife kind of scares me. <laughs> I don't want her coming after you. Sorry for stealing your horse. Well, come back to town. Let's discuss it at least. You know me, my mind's all made up. University, Eastern Colorado. How do I find this lab? It's in the science building. Looks like a giant mirror. You, you can't miss it. You take care of that wife of yours. There's a place for you here. You know? You good? I'm good. Adios, little brother. <laughs> 